Hi guys, Julia here and today we have a shop critique of one of Etsy shops and we look at the shop in general and uh, make SEO analysis of one of its listings. As well, we give some recommendations about traffic and increasing of traffic and SEO. So, if you want to have a free shop critique, join our Facebook group and leave your request. The link in the description. Okay, let's start. And today we have a really amazing shop for our critic review. But at first I would like to say thank you Alana and Dana for participation in our shop critique. And my first impression about uh, your shop is just wow. It's so tender, it's so girly. And uh, of course I have this impression because of your branding. So the first we can see while opening your shop uh, and visiting your shop. So we can see a wonderful banner with so tender and beautiful flowers and so interesting and intricate letters and the same I can I can say about your shop icon but uh, pay attention that you need that is from my point of view you need to add uh, the photo for shop owner of course uh, you have like two owners but it means that it's just easy way to solve this issue make a photo where you are together and that's also we can see and your customers can see who you are alana and dana and let's talk about your listings you have 24 listings and you have sections it's good for searching on your shop you have featured items and let's talk about uh, your li your listings and uh, to be more concrete about your photos pay attention that uh, looking at your photos we can uh, notice that uh, they have different colors i'm talking about period of photo shooting for example uh, this one is not so bright. It looks like it needs more daylight in comparison with this one. Yes, I think that you can notice the difference. So my recommendation is to use this one or this one. But of course, this one is better because it uh, looks clearer as for customers. It's cool that you uh, use here not just like your glass, but some accessories that uh, make some accents and add additional feelings, additional emotions. So uh, continue doing like this, this way. Because, for example, we can uh, see uh, these four photos. Compare them and try to look at them from the point of view of your customers. For example, this one i like it because it uh, looks alive because here you show you present your items how they can uh, be used so it's quite understandable for your customers from uh, the first mm, glance at your photo that oh hmm, it's like a picture that i can uh, have uh, buying these items so just uh, keep in mind that that is really good good idea to present this way and for example when you compare with this one okay uh, this photo photo is great but that is not so interesting not so catching as uh, this one because here you have only marble background background and and that's all like okay but it's not like the whole picture that can be presented to your customer and and that can explain the story the the usage and so on and let's compare this photo and this photo uh, here you have only back uh, background like marble background and here you have the same marble background but uh, you added a bottle and um, it looks another just uh, because of this um, bottle like one more accessory for you but it looks more interesting so pay attention that this one is good but not so good as for example this one 
or this one. Okay, that is my recommendation is for photos. And let's have a look at your uh, about section. I feel that uh, you do not want to tell about you, but it's really, really important. Here you have your Instagram. It's okay. It's like additional channel to get more customers but mind that you can use here also pinterest it's also a very very good platform for additional channel but you do not have any story about you any picture or video so mind uh, this that that is very important because for example you uh, do not have your uh, shop owner's photo you do not have any description about you who you are and so on in about me section so as we can see you have in your description that that is personalized designs but at the same time we cannot understand uh, your person so it's a bit confusing i always start my shop critique uh, with a quick shop analysis to understand your weak and strong sides and uh, let's summarize that uh, you need to work with your photos and you need to add more information about you about your personalities about your story and add pinterest here like to get more social media uh, to increase traffic to your shop and let's continue our shop uh, analysis with the seo uh, analysis of one of your listings i guess you know that all listings uh, need optimization and now we are going to identify whether you have enough optimization enough uh, effective optimization for your listings and for this i always use sellerway and uh, if you guys are unfamiliar with sellerway that is a website that is created especially for etsy sellers and with the help of the tools of this uh, site you can make analysis of your shop and you can make seo analysis and also you can choose good and effective keywords for increasing of traffic to your shop so let's start i have already logged in so let's let's go ahead here on the left you can see a set of tools that sellerway presents to us so you can choose any and uh, check it and test it when you have free time but now we need shop analysis plus to uh, identify uh, information basic information about your shop so uh, here we need to enter a shop name and let's do this okay i'm ready I hit the button so uh, here as you can see we can identify age and you are really really fresh two months only number of listings 24 and it means that you need to add more and more listings to be more and more active on etsy because it will be more effective for you for your business for sales in general okay number of sales uh, and average price and country sales per month okay let's move on and here we can see information about recent listings and uh, uh, for example now we are going to pay more attention as for views per day and okay as for views per day we have zero here here one and one and one again zero one okay as i can see it's not enough it's really not enough because it's very very low number for views per day because uh, to have sales to have enough sales you need to have at least 15 or 20 perfect it will be if you have 20 views per day so of course we need some optimization of your listing and let's choose one of them and i chose this one and now we're going to analyze uh, this uh, listing for having enough information whether your keywords are effective and working for your items okay for this we need one more tool and that is key compare plus with the help of this tool we are going to uh, compare your keywords and we need to put uh, here 
your keywords i will put here keywords from your listing well i've done it and uh, let's compare our keywords hit the button so while downloading the information i can uh, tell you about color guide that we have here and in this color guide we can see that uh, there are two factors two criteria uh, that we need uh, to identify uh, whether our keywords are effective enough so competition rate and it's divided into high medium and low so uh, our goal is to have um, low competition rate as it means that not so many people listings on etsy have the same keywords that you are using in your listings so that is our goal use uh, listings with low competition rate and as for view rate it means that uh, here on the contrary our uh, goal is to use high com high view rate and that is divided also into high medium and low but high uh, view rate means that a lot of people are uh, looking for items with the help of uh, these keywords. So the perfect uh, combination is low competition rate and high view rate. It means just ideal situation when you have keywords with uh, low competition rate and high view rate. Or at least it can be low competition rate and medium view rate, uh, medium competition rate and high view rate or medium view rate so um, try to avoid high competition rate and low view rate because because it's not really effective not effective so let's have a look and pay attention that uh, in your situation that can be uh, really the reason why you have so a uh, low number of uh, views per day because too many listings or uh, on etsy have the same keywords that you use but you have at least a medium view rate but um, in combination with high competition rate it's not really effective so also we are going to find more effective keywords that you can use in your listings and uh, with the help of which you can optimize your listings and uh, have more traffic and increase your traffic to your shop so for this purpose we need keywords so we are going to use uh, this tool and here we need to enter keywords i will um, take one from your title okay let's search and while downloading we also hear a color guide and uh, i need to repeat one more time that pay attention really it's really really crucial and important information because of uh, these factors are very 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 significant so competition rate here our target is to uh, get low competition rate and view rate we need to uh, to find uh, keywords with at least uh, medium or high view rate and okay our results are ready so pay attention that you have uh, a lot of uh, variants to use with the medium competition rate it's it's good and by the way you can uh, see that there are three pages so you can mm, find more variants for you to to use and it uh, it is really important to find among these uh, results variants that will be related to your items because in case uh, you uh, use just good uh, like keywords but they will be not so effective because of they are too wide for example for for you for your items and it uh, will bring you views but not sales actually so uh, let's analyze. I use uh, Shop Analysis Plus uh, for uh, identification, general basic information about your shop and to understand information and to get information about your listings and to understand whether they are good and effective and uh, enough optimized for working on Etsy. Then I uh, use Key Compare Plus to understand uh, whether your keywords 
uh, have low competition rate and uh, uh, high view rate. And then with the help of keywords, I can find uh, just uh, best results for my uh, listings. Okay, because you have three pages and I believe that you can find among all of these results uh, some, something that uh, you need, something that bring, uh, brings you more uh, traffic to your shop. Okay, so pay attention that you need to work with your photos, with information about uh, your uh, personalities and mind that you need to optimize your listings and in this way you uh, will get more traffic to your shop. Okay, thank you one more time for participation in our uh, shop critique and thank you for watching this video and if you found it helpful hit the like button subscribe to the channel and leave your comments in the comment section below bye